Hey, so today I'm gonna to go over how to set up Visual Studio Code to use with Rust. It'll be quick to the point with no frills. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go open our extensions and install the Rust Analyzer. This is the most important extension you'll have. This will give you inlay hinting for your Rust code. So it's installing and we can see that it's starting up right down here. And by the time it's done, we'll get these hints. That's exactly what we want. The next thing we want is syntax highlighting for our cargo.toml files. So we'll have even better Toml. This extension will give us highlighting for the Toml file. Look at that, beautiful. The last thing you'll need for a Visual Studio Code setup is going to be crates. This will give us hints in our cargo.toml file to see if we have the most up-to-date version of the crate. Now what else might be helpful is to set up a keyboard shortcut to run a cargo runnable. I have command shift enter that allows me to select a runnable from an active Rust workspace. So I like to use this to run cargo check. It makes it a lot easier for me to just kind of be in the flow and constantly check my code. The keyboard shortcut that you'll need for this is gonna be right here. We wanna specify in our key bindings.json file, the key, which is in my case, shift command enter. And then the command is gonna be Rust analyzer run. It'll make it a lot easier for you to have a shortcut to just run and check your code right away. All right, that's it, no frills.